Hello, I'm Christy Welch, Direct Marketing Specialist with The Ohio State University Extension. And I'm here today to share information with you about thinking inside the box, growing CSAs across the tri-state region. So if you've never heard of a CSA, CSA stands for Community Supported Agriculture. And really you can almost think of it as a subscription to locally produced food. And so farmers will uh, work with customers to sign them up for a share and of what's produced on the farm. Sometimes that's a weekly share, sometimes it's a bi-weekly share. Uh, each farm does it a little bit differently, but it's a way for consumers to get a consistent supply of fresh locally produced foods. And, you know, it used to be when we thought about CSAs, we talked about mainly fresh produce. There are still many CSAs that offer fresh produce, but there are also lots of CSAs that offer other products like locally produced meat, dairy, value added products like GMs, jellies, maple syrup, honey, um, baked goods, so bakers that make bread with locally produced grains and those kinds of things. And then to make it as convenient for customers as possible, some CSA operators are using multi-farm CSAs. So maybe I produce the produce, another farmer produces the meat and protein products, another farmer does the breads, another farmer does the value added. So again, you can get a full experience in your CSA. And so one of the things that you need to think about is a CSA right for your farm. And so our 2022 Tri-State CSA Conference, which is coming up November 12th and 13th in Fort Wayne, Indiana, is a place for you to learn whether CSA might be right for your farm. Whether you're just thinking about it or whether you've been doing it for 10 years and want to grow and improve, this is a great opportunity for you to learn more about growing CSAs across the Tri-State region. We look forward to seeing you there.